thank you for taking the time to join us today. My name is Mike Allen. I'm with the small business team here at Cisco. Extension Mobility allows you to temporarily apply your phone number and user profile to a shared Cisco IP phone. To demo Extension Mobility, a few things have to happen first. One, your system administrator has to assign a phone with a logout user profile. In an effort not to get too technical, basically what that means is there's not an ePhone DN assigned to a user and this ePhone or this telephone. The second thing that has to happen, or two, is the user has to have a login user profile, meaning access to be able to use extension mobility on this phone. Now, a couple things. In order to show you how this works, I'm going to press the services key. And you'll notice that there's quite a few different options here in the services menu. And I'm going to zoom in on the display for you to see this. We've got things like uh, CME service URL, Voice View Express. I've got WebEx meetings and time card viewer here on my demo kit. What you're going to want to do is scroll until you see the option for extension mobility. Once you see that option, go ahead and hit the select button. And on my demo kit, my username is M. Scott. And my password is 1234. I'm going to click Submit. The phone is going to reset, and when it comes back, what it's going to have is all of my user options for M. Scott, such as buttons on the side. I'm going to actually have my ePhone DNs or programming buttons. So whatever that user has set up for their login user profile, such as speed dial keys, other users, um, your actual uh, line itself, or like I said, ePhone DN itself, you're going to have message waiting indication. So if this phone were, was to have a uh, voicemail on it right now, the message waiting indication light would go off. And then I'm going to have all of my call processing that I would normally have at a standard user phone. So a couple quick applications, keeping with uh, the, the general consensus of these podcasts. A couple quick applications would be, let's say you've got uh, real estate offices, where you've got shared areas where different agents might be sharing desks or a certain phone. Uh, car dealerships, where you'll see most of the time car, dealer, or car, car salesmen actually sharing an office or sharing a certain phone. They walk into the office, they sign into their phone, all of their calls are then presented to them as they come in, their voicemail is there, their buttons are there. Personally, I use this at the Cisco offices. I travel between quite a few of them. When I get to an office, I actually sign in the exact same way I just showed you, and I get my call processing. I get my voicemail, and again, I get my buttons. What this has really helped me do is eliminate a lot of my wireless costs. So instead of constantly being on my cell phone, worrying about coverage, and just basically hiking up those minutes, whenever I'm in a Cisco office, I can use a extension mobility-enabled telephone. So again, this was Mike Allen. Thanks for joining this podcast today, and good selling.